Eye catching as the ceremony itself will be the fashion worn by the royal family and their guests. Eyewitness News reporter Jane Carabeo joins us with the story of one Chester County woman who is a designer with a royal connection. Yes, we're talking about royal hats this morning, you guys. She's a milliner, also known as a hat maker, and her formal training is with the best of the best in Britain. But her journey wasn't always clear. Okay, so. It's here in her quiet Chester County studio where Zoya Egan dreams up designs and brings them to life. She's going to wear it to the Devon Horse Show. Whimsical and vibrant, each hat is one of a kind. I like something with a little oomph. Creating that oomph isn't easy. The stitches has to be invisible. Painstakingly hand-stitched, completing one hat can take up to two weeks. No doubt, though, this is a labor of love. I always wanted to create something. I was always very crafty. Zoya learned how to sew at seven years old, helping her accomplished seamstress mother in Russia. But it wasn't until she was an adult living in Pennsylvania, unfulfilled with a computer science degree, that she found her way to hats. Millinery came as an accident. Zoya needed a hat for the Radnor Hunt hat contest. This was the final product and she won. Women loved it. Everyone was asking me questions if that's what I do. Discovering her passion, Zoya traveled to London to train with master milliner Dylan Walwork. Dylan was working for Philip Somerville, who used to be a milliner uh, providing hats for the royal house. That's right. Zoya learned from a milliner who has made hats for the late Princess Diana and Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. It's only one person between me and the Queen, <laughs> and it's Dylan. Now, Zoya is running her own business, Hats by Zoya, and looking forward to being inspired by the upcoming royal wedding. Well, the Queen has the total look. She is the icon. Always dressed to the tee. Uh, beautiful hats, beautiful clothing. For her own clients, first Zoya finds a flattering shape. And it looks great on you. And then designs a look complimentary to the outfit. And seeing the final product, especially on a client, that's the best feeling in the world. And this is now crunch time for Zoya. As you can imagine, she's busiest in the weeks leading up to the Radnor Hunt and the Devon Horse Show, both coming up this month. But tonight, you can learn firsthand from Zoya. She's holding a class at the Logan Hotel at 530. Registration is required. Oh, that's going to sell out that class. So what hat wow. did I choose, you guys? Here we go. How's it look? Very nice. Yeah, looking good, Jan. Do I look ready for the royal wedding? You do. You I do. still have time to get there. Mm -hmm. You can come they with me. They want to send me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know. Mm -hmm. can be your date. Yep. Here we go. Mm -hmm. yep. It's all set. We're ready. Looking good, Jan. Thank you. <laughs> CBS3 is your royal we wedding destination. You can watch the wedding live on Saturday morning here on CBS3 or stream it live on CBSPhilly.com and on our Facebook page starting bright and early at 4 a.m.